Okay ba? Hi Freshies! Welcome again to my channel and na miss nyo ba ako? I know I haven't been uploading lately but I'm still active. And I'm active on my Facebook fan page that is The Beauty Junkie on Facebook. And I've been doing a lot of live videos in there, tutorials, makeup reviews, and whatnot. So, if you don't catch me on YouTube, definitely you will catch me on Facebook. Yesterday, I went to the launch of BLK Cosmetics' second collection, and that is the K Beauty Collection. And I'll be flashing some photos of the event on your right hand side of the screen. So, make it in your action. So, as I'm talking, tingnan nyo lang. So, the BLK K Beauty Collection, marami sa inyo alam na si Anne Curtis is a big fan of K drama, anything Korean pop culture. Um, and she's very vocal about this on her social media accounts. And one I remember was yung kay Gong Yu when she was able to meet him, nag-gush talaga siya. So, that goes to show Anne is really into K-drama and anything Korean for that matter. Therefore, this collection that she launched is just so fitting for the brand and for her personality as well. Okay, so the launch was held at Dessert Museum. This was just yesterday. And of course, we got to take home some products from the line. Actually, not some. All products from the line, not all the shades, but every item in the collection we got to take home. So in this video, I am going to show you um, the swatches of these products and all of the products from her collection as well as my thoughts. And as you can see naman, wala akong makeup ngayon and isi-share ko sa inyo yan while we are going to do a K-Beauty makeup using BLK Cosmetics K-Beauty Collection. If you want to know more about these products and if you want to see how they perform and my thoughts about it, and keep on watching. <laughs> so the products, they came in this bag and it says, Life is complicated, your makeup should not be. So obviously, wala siyang laman because I laid out all the products here so it will be easier for me to reach out and review the products. The the entire collection, K-Beauty collection, number one, it's very, very cute. And the products included are, we have a foundation stick. So it's a BB and CC stick. Finally, my foundation na siya. We also have um, an eye color. We have cheek tints, of course, staple yan sa K-Beauty. And we also have lipsticks. And ano pa ba? we have a set. Tapos merong mirror dito. And I am not just sure kung kasama to sa mga for sale items or if this is a freebie. So, ito yung mirror. Really, really cute. Ayan. The products are sold individually. You can buy them per piece. But, they also came up with a K-Beauty starter kit. So, for Anne, um, for her, this is yung um, kit that will give you the BLK Cosmetics K-Beauty look. Their version of the K-Beauty look. So, what's inside is this. Ayan siya. So, you have here the foundation stick, you have the eyeshadow, cream eyeshadow, and then you have the lip and cheek water tint. And then inside also, you will get stickers. So, really, really cute yung stickers. And this entire set is, I think it's here, 997 pesos for all of the products. And you also get a box. Now, itong box na to, itong part na to natatanggal yan. So, you can recycle the box after you have taken out the products. On this side, it also says um, some tips and tricks on how you can use all of the products. So, yan. Meron kang cheat sheet dito. Um, it's really nice and um, ang ganda ng box. As I said, super cute nung BLK um, collection na to. Ang ganda lang nung, nung um, concept niya, art concept niya. Really cute. Now, some details about this set. I am not sure, but I asked in the event. Um, I think the set only features a set of colors, meaning you cannot change the colors. Now, my problem here is for the cream stick, etong stick foundation, because the shade na kasama sa kanya is ivory beige. And it's really, really fair. As in, I can't even use it as concealer because sobrang puti niya talaga for me. And when I swatched it, it has a very neutral undertone. So, that's the reason why parang halos pa white na yung color niya on me. Because, you know, I'm Morena. Kaya, yun lang yung hindi ko gusto sa kanya. Because if I'm gonna buy this, I am really, really interested in the foundation stick. Because I'm a foundation girl. But for the, the eye color, eyeshadow color, okay naman siya. It's... Um, 
what do you call this? Para siyang mid tone brown. And then the lip tint is um, color pink. So, yun lang yung issue ko with this box. So, um, I think if they can change with the rules on this, maybe they can allow people to customize this one. So, yun. Kasi, for Morenas, if you're gonna buy this set, hindi mo talaga masus masusulit. Next, let us go to the products in this kit. So, this kit, as I said, it contains the BB plus CC stick. Now, this is the foundation, and this is what the stick looks like. Now, this stick has two ends. So, yung one end is a brush. So, it's a flat brush. Now, this brush, I like this type of brush because it's very perfect for cream foundation. So, this other end, this is where you will see the foundation. BB plus CC stick yung tawag sa kanya. So, this is the other end. So, meron siyang round thing in the middle. The round thing in the middle, I believe, is the CC product. CC, um, it's a color correcting cream. So, maybe that's why it's a bit lighter. And then, the external part is the BB. So, yun yung skin tone mo. And this one is, I guess, it um, kind of neutralizes the color. And when it's mixed with the BB, it kind of evens out your skin tone and provides a bit of concealing. Um, effect because lighter nga siya. So that is the foundation. Mamaya natin ito try yan. Now this foundation, it comes in three shades. And then they said in their account, it's perfect for fair, medium, and morena skin tones. So for morenas like me, yung shade nyo is natural beige. So this is what I got. So next in this kit, andito pa rin tayo sa kit, is the Intense Color Liquid Eyeshadow. Ayan. So, no una tong nakita ng mga tao sa event, they thought that this was a nail polish or um, a lip and cheek tint, but the color does not tell that. And then, closer look revealed na it is a color liquid eyeshadow. So, this is a liquid eyeshadow. But when I swatch this, it's it has more of like a cream consistency to it. So, swatch lang natin. Ayan. So, ito yung color niya. Now, this one, it is very, very pigmented. So, you would only need a few dots to make it work and to add color on your eyelids. And besides, with the K-Beauty look, merong color but nothing intense and nothing like too loud or matte or bold for the K-Beauty look. The shade Gorgeous, para siyang um, mid-tone brown and there's a hint of red in the shade. Final item in the set, the K-Beauty Starter Kit is the All Day Lip and Cheek Water Tint. Last one. So this is the lip and cheek tint, yung water tint nila. And it has a gel-like consistency. And then ito yung applicator ng product. It is like a paddle brush. Ayan. A lot of people might think this is small, but tints naman, they're Tints nowadays, most especially, they're very pigmented. And besides, you don't really use a tint, especially even in this size, in like what, in one month, two months. Kasi yun, pigmented na nga yung mga tints ngayon. And also, this one pigmented na rin siya. So, swatch natin tung tint na to. The color of this tint is called pink. Ayan. Ito siya. Pink ba? I find it more to be like a berry shade. So, Yon, yun yung tingin ko sa kanya. And as you can see, very pigmented yung tint. That's just one swipe. Tapos pag minix mo siya, ayan, naglilip pa rin siya ng tint. Oh, but then again, nakita nyo, meron like parang patch of color that's left. So that goes to show mabilis siya magset. So once you apply it, you have to blend it right away. Alright, so that is the K Beauty starter kit for you. Let's now go to the individual products. So, the next product in the line that I want to show you is this one. So, ayan ang kanyang packaging. And this is the product. Ayan. So, really cute. At first, I thought it was lip balm. Yung itsura niya. As you can see, the applicator is incredibly big. Really big. Hindi siya for lips talaga kasi ang laki niya. Pang cheeks talaga. And it's very pigmented. The shade I have here is called Peach. I'm gonna swatch it very quickly for you. So, that is Peach. And this color is perfect for Morenas. Now, this one, 
I know, I will get this correctly. Two shades lang siya. Strawberry and peach. Strawberry is a milky pink shade and it's more suited for fairer skin tones. And peach is perfect for warmer skin tones. Compared to regular cheek tints, na maliit lang, this one, malaki siya. So, kasi pang cheeks talaga. What I love about this is ang laki na niya. So, one swipe, you're good. And then, dab mo na lang. Don't have to um, do what you would do with regular lip and cheek tint sa maliit yung bond na ganun-ganun ka pa. That one kasi, I think it takes up more time because you're swiping some layers on your skin and it gives the first layers more time, you know, to dry up faster and create those streaks on your cheeks. Whereas with this one, perfect in size, when you swipe it, dab-dab mo lang and then you're done. And last but not the least, there are three new lipsticks in the line. So yung lipstick niya, yan, so all day Intense Matte Lipstick. There are three new shades. So, ayan. These are the boxes of the new shades. These are the new lipsticks. Ang cute lang nung yung BLK instead of the black font. Peach naman yung color niya ngayon. And it comes in the brand's Signature Ice Cube Lipstick Packaging. Alright, so I'm gonna show you the lipsticks one by one. So, this is like a peach shade. This one is a rose shade. And then the last one is a red shade. Yeah. Alright, so those are all the products in the range. Not all the colors, but these are everything. I'm sure this is your most awaited part. The swatching and then the K-Beauty makeup look. So as we go along, I'm gonna tell you my um, observations with the product. So if you want to check that out, then Continue with this video. Keep on watching. Before I start with um, my face, I'm going to start with the eyeshadow. As I said, this is very pigmented. So this is one technique that I would like to share with you. So maglalagay lang ako dito. Ayan, on the back of my hand. And I am going to, you know, just dab my finger on it. Ganyan. Tapos, as you can see... And as you can see, meron na siyang konti. And I'm just gonna dab it a little more on the cleaner parts just to take out some excess. Tapos, ilalagay ko na siya straight on my eyelid. Now, I did not put anything on my eyelid because nang natest ko siya, you can wear it on its own. It's waterproof, very long-lasting. That's why hindi ko siya lalagyan na ng primer. That's what I like about this. So, i-apply ko lang siya very close to the lash line. And in case kulang pa, ayan, you just take out some color from the back of your hand. With K-Beauty makeup looks, as in talagang wash of color lang on the skin. You can see that there's color, but at the same time, hindi naman siya over the top. Alright, so ito na yung ating foundation, the moment of truth. So ayan, papakita ko sa inyo kung okay talaga siya for morenas. I'm Morena, as you can see, and this particular shade is like a shade lighter than my skin tone. So I can't really say na pang Morena, Morena talaga siya. So that's why apply sparingly lang, just enough to, you know, give your skin a bit, bit of tint and to cover some imperfections. Um, pwede rin siya gamitin as concealer. So, no need na for a separate concealer. So, the foundation stick, it has um, a creamy texture. Glides very easily. And the finish is semi-matte. Yan siya. Not flat matte. Hindi naman siya heavy. It um, evens out the skin tone nicely and conceals some imperfections. But for the really heavy ones, you need concealer. So, ito lang. Comparison lang sa kabila. Ayan siya. Finish is very skin-like. So, perfect to para dun sa mga gusto na natural lang. And besides, with K-Beauty look, with their foundation, they like it dewy. They like it skin-like. Nothing totally matte or totally heavy. Okay, so this is now the foundation. See, natural beige. As you can see, hindi siya pang morena. So, I'm just gonna use the MAC shade system for this. Um, video kasi it's a shade system that everyone's familiar with. So, kung ikaw ay mga nasa shade range ng NC35 to NC40, ayan, you will love this foundation. But for mga NC42 like me, na morena talaga, yan, hindi po siya pang morena. 
Alright, so before I set my face with powder, I'm going to use this one, si Creamy Cheek Paint. So what we're gonna do here, on this side, I'm going to apply it on top of foundation. And then on this side, I'm going to use it on top of powder. So may kita natin kung um, where it will work best. I think on this side, so yan, maglalagay lang ko ng isang line na ganyan. That's enough. This is also pigmented, ah, so hinay-hinay lang best. So this is the peach blush. So as you can see, um, it's nice. It looks very natural and kahit maputing foundation ko, I can see na this is really good for morenas like me. Yan, may powder na yung kabilang side of my face. Apply natin siya. Same amount. Maganda rin siya i-blend on top of makeup. I think the reason why it's good on top of makeup because of the milky texture, it makes the product, you know, very easy to spread without you having to, like, um apply force in blending it whereas with the mga watery tints the problem is um, aside from mabilis mag evaporate yung water hindi siya na, the wa water is not effective in spreading the pigment properly that's why you get those patchy stains on your cheeks and also I'd like to note um, when the tint dries up para lang siyang parang moist on the skin, pero hindi yung sobrang sticky or greasy. Not, I mean, not even, you know, watery. It has a semi-matte finish, but you can definitely feel a bit of moisture on it. And even if hindi mo siya iset, I find that okay lang siya. It does not run off. It does not um, evaporate. Not unless you have really, really oily skin. And I think it also helps that, you know, the powder helps in, you know, keeping it on the skin. Kasi inapply mo siya on top of powder. Okay, matatapos na tayo guys. So, let's go to All Day Lip and Cheek Water Tint. So, it's this one. Again, the shade I have is called Pink. So, ap apply natin to. Maglilipstick tayo later, but matatak pa naman siya nun. So, I just want to show lang how the tint looks like. Ayan. Ayan siya. Really pretty. Uh, and also this tint, oh my god, it smells like pomegranate. Hindi pa siya nagsasettle. Buti na lang na moisturize ko yung lips ko kanina. <laughs> Staying power is probably around mga 2 to 3 hours. If you don't use your lips, but if kumakain ka, ayan, magka-fade siya. Pero may iwan pa rin konting tint. But of course, parang medyo insignificant na. So definitely, you have to retouch. Let's now go to the lipsticks. For the lipsticks, I'd like to swatch first si Beautiful. So this is the first shade. And this is the rose shade. It's like a peony pink shade with a hint of rose. Next is I'm going to try Honey. This is the dark red shade or yung parang crushed red petal shade. Hmm, pretty shade. It's like a parang diluted kind of red. And finally, we're going to try the last shade and that is My Love. I like the shade. And that is all for our review, swatch, and makeup look featuring BLK Cosmetics K Beauty Collection. What I like about the entire collection is the products are well researched. The colors you'll find them in um, a lot of K Beauty brands, Korean brands to be exact. And also the design, so cute. And all the products are really useful, really um, friendly for all people with all sorts of makeup skill levels. So whether you're a beginner or an expert, you will definitely find something that you will um, love and can use from this collection. The products I love from this collection are number one. Of course, number one on my list is the Creamy Cheek Paint. Anne said it herself, she's proud of this cheek paint. I agree, maganda talaga tong cheek paint na to because pigmented. And you can use it over or under makeup. And it doesn't need to be set with powder. And despite that, it can still last for, you know, quite a good amount of time. And also this eyeshadow, this liquid eyeshadow, I like this one too. And also the shade called Gorgeous. So it's what I'm wearing right now. It's a really friendly everyday brown. Good for almost all skin tones and very easy to work with. Safe kind of brown but you know for everyday use that's okay. And that is all for our review, swatch, and makeup look featuring 
BLK Cosmetics K Beauty Collection. I hope you like this video. Give it a thumbs up if you like it. Share it to your friends if you found it informative. And most especially to your friends who are fans of Anne Curtis, fans of makeup, and fans of BLK Cosmetics. Don't forget to like my social media accounts, subscribe to my channel, visit my blog, my Facebook fan page, and I'll see you guys again in the next video. Thank you.